Well, today we're going to DNA test that thing. This one is 15 years old in August, and right now it's April. <laughs> Next week is May. We got a wisdom panel, which is supposedly the world's leading DNA service developed with veterinarians, not veterans. When you open the box, it says, do not destroy. This is your shipping container, and on the back of this, there is a big U USPS shipping label, which I am not showing the camera, but there is one wife. If we open it up, it's got the sticky stuff to put it back together. And if we flip it open, it's got the swabby, like a COVID test. The QR code, I think for us, ready to collect your D your cat's DNA like a pro, scan the code below. That one's for you and I, wife. Okay. Visit your stuff on this website. You must activate your test before mailing the DNA sample. Oh, that's what this is. Yep. Slightly peel back the swab above the sleeve. Wait for approximately two hours after a meal or a treat, which we did. Obtain cheek cells by firmly roaming bristles between cheeks and gums for about 15 seconds. And they have a little picture there of you doing that to your poor cat. It, it be dying. Not really. Let's swab air dry for at least five minutes. Repeat steps two to four for the second swab. And there are two in here. Be sure to use both swabs on the same mat. Once both stars are dry, insert them bristle first into this protective sleeve. Do not res reseal it. Okay. Write owner and pet name on sleeve label. Here. Place sleeve with swabs back in the mailbox, seal carton, and mail it. So, let's torture my old cat. Before we tor torture this old girl, I do think she's mostly Siamese because she's got like the fire point and when she was a kitten she just had the ears and some of her tail. She like peached out as she got older. She also has the blue eyes, she's chatty, and she's got jiggle eyes since she was a kitten. Uh, if that's not since you were a kitten or since your cat's a kitten, that's an actual neurological thing, but apparently most Siamese cats have jiggly eyes. So I think she's a lot of Siamese. She's really lazy and uh, receptive to whatever I do to her, so I think she might also have some ragdoll in her who also have these colors. But the black one, I have no idea what he is. He has darkness right now. Yeah, we'll be doing that with him. We'll be doing this with him another time. But, since she's getting old, and you, mm, I do this because I love you, and I want to know more about you. 15 seconds? Yep. One... Oh, stop. Mm -hmm. Sorry. I know you're old, girl. One, two, three. Sorry. Sorry, baby. Yeah, ragdoll, right? Four, five, six, seven. I'm sure there are better ways to do this. Seven, eight, nine, ten. I think I missed. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Almost okay. done. You're a good girl. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I gotta let it air dry for five minutes. Yeah, but we could do the other one off camera since she don't like that. Yeah. We got our test results back for the fat kitty. Yee. Who's over there sleeping in her pink bed? Uh, and let's see how this goes. We got a few results. But uh, you should be synced up here. <laughs> Ooh. Let's see. Where, how, how does this shit work? Scroll down. Okay, hold on. We'll put a picture in later. Ooh, if I read. She's some sphinx. Of course you'd be domestic cat. American domestic cat, which is like American domestic short hair. She's Persian. Ha! Huh. Scottish fold. She's Sphinx. Oh, she's a Scottish fold! Yay! And she's Norwegian forest cat. This kind of makes sense. Can... Unlocking the mysteries. What is this? 
No, yeah, no health concerns, this fatty. Alright, yeah, let's look at all this. I'm so excited. More to results. The five breeds in my fat. So, it's most of it's western. And then two Persian. Okay. <coughs> There's the, invest the domestic. There's the Persian. I don't really see it too. I guess some of her fur. Yeah. I see it. The Scottish fold her face, probably. Yeah. She got big, stupid eyes. It's the Sphinx that's throwing me off. She don't look like that at all. It must be recessive. Norwegian forest cat, I think they're similar to like Persians and stuff, but they're, they're from the totally, they're from the Western area. What what happens if I click on Persian? Sweet, adaptable cats, the flat faces, the round eyes, low key and gentle. It gets them off everyone except for other cats. <laughs> There's history and traits, coloring, temperament. C content to play with cat toys and lounge around on comfy piece of fur. Yeah, that's what she's doing like, right now. Like legit. I don't know how well that will come through, but that's what she's doing right now. I, I know, I know American domestic. That doesn't surprise me at all. The Sphinx is the one that's throwing me off. I, I know what a Sphinx is. Wedge-shaped heads. That's not her. Massive ears. They're not massive. Lemon-shaped eyes. They are lemon-shaped. They are independent. She's definitely independent. She is not social. Mm -mm. No, that's not her. They have wax buildup. So they're right here. Sphinx need weekly ear cleanings to remove wax. But she didn't get that until she started to get old. So I don't know. It's a little. It's got. That's got to be a dormant gene. It's also only eleven. No, it's 12. <coughs> I mean, she's mostly an American. I don't know much about the Norwegian forest cats. Thick heads. The triangular and... Th oh, yeah, she would she would hit her head into the door to get in. The almond-shaped eye, maybe. Strong appearance, broad chest, powerful legs. I guess her a little. Friendly disposition, easy going. Good with dogs and other pets. That's not Eva. Eva, she might be good with kids. Nope. Not well. You know that's because she got fat though. When she was a kitten, she likes to, used to like to be really high up. They like to stay Towards near. They like to, they like to chase. Eva likes that. What you saw? They like to stay near their people. But not too close. That is her. That is her. That's a hundred percent her. Lounge on the back of the couch. Rather, on the back of the couch than someone's lap. Yep. Okay. <coughs> so that's probably where she gets it. That sounds right. Okay. This makes a lot of sense, right? So her... Yeah. That's kind of cool seeing that. A lot of American domestic. Okay. So one but that makes sense. sense. Yeah, and then the other one was a big mutt. Yep. Okay. He was DNA... It's highly diverse. Oh, she's on the high end. That's kind of cool. All right. Well, that help. Health. They said there were no problems. Genetic. So there's no genetic factors. So she has no blood deficiencies. Okay. So clotting. So she has. So this is about medicine getting absorbed. Yep. Another blood clotting. De de never decreased appetite, never with that cat. A joint disease, well that's good, because she's getting old. Ear fold, variant of breed, for folding. She uh, she wouldn't have that, because her Scottish fold is so small. That's for cats that it really like comes down. She wouldn't have that anyway. Muscle weakness, all right. She's A, like you. <laughs> All right, traits. Color point, I knew that. Dilution. What is this? A lightning of coat color pigments. Hmm. I guess that makes sense because she's, she's white. She's very white. Yeah, I mean, I know she's white. So the color point, that's where it is on her plot, but that's mostly, I know that looking at her, that's her ears and her face. That's a, a color There's point. There's 10 more. Well, it says no copies. 
So I guess she only. So she didn't, really isn't. So these are all the other tests. Huh? She only has these two. Yep. She doesn't have albinoism. Guess not. She's not Oriental. The eyes must. Okay. The eyes must just be that. Long, long hair. Long coat possible. Short coat likely. So it's a recessive gene. Yeah. Hair. Tail length. Long, long tail? tail. She got a medium tail. I would say she. She doesn't have a short tail. No, she doesn't. I would say she's a me medium. Her toes. Four and each. <laughs> she got normal ass feet. All right. Yay. Hey, this is cool. Fourteen years, nine months. Wow, they did that. From, they got that from the blood work. Or no, I no, you gave them. Yeah, I was like, I was about to be really impressed. Wow, that's cool. Full trait results. That's just where. That's where we were. Yeah. Okay. Well, hey, that's pretty cool. Yeah. That was oh, worth it. Our baby. Yeah. I didn't. I would have never thought Sphinx. Or Scottish Fold. Nah, no. Yeah. You waking up there, you fat? No, nope, she's back to sleep now. <laughs> hey, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. Mm. On the F-bomb, she's Soccer 12. We're Nick Bro Inc. Oh, you love that. Mm. And, yeah, thanks for watching. Goodbye.